My name is Zane Brown. I'm the Type 3 Incident Commander for the Alaska Type 3 Incident Management Team. So we're currently at 90% containment of Swan Lake Fire. Uh, this being the only area uncontained and we'll be doing a handoff to State Forestry to the Kenai Kodiak area. This area here up in Resurrection Pass uh, still had some active fire perimeter which we secured. We did some suppression repair on some of the hand line that was uh, put in place to contain those areas. And that's all completed. Uh, we moved around, uh, secured some areas here, some backhaul of some equipment off of, uh, out of this area. Um, another thing that we've been working on is mitigating hazards to the public of any trees coming down along these public roads. Hi, I'm Operations Trainee Dan Osborne here in the Swan Lake Fire. Uh, other stuff we had going on today, we did a recon flight and uh, flew this area in the Vision Kilo and just to see what heat we have remaining in that area. There are a few uh, visible smokes there, but uh, a really uh, low concern due to the seasonality and the location. Don't be alarmed to be seeing smoke, especially along the Ski Lap Loop Road. There are some uh, peat box burning adjacent to the road, so there's going to be some long-term uh, visible stuff. Uh, we've also had, in the last couple days, with the wind we've had, uh, numerous trees falling on the Ski Lap Loop Road. So uh, that's just going to be an ongoing uh, concern throughout the fall and winter as those trees just weaken and fall over. Uh, just be cautious as you're using that area because uh, it is a freshly burned area. So we're unable to mitigate all those hazards, but just just be aware of those. The overall still suppression for the Kenai National Wildlife Refuge, that's still going to be managed by the Division of Forestry, but the repair stuff the burn air emergency response will be taken care of by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. And then when we get over around to the U.S. Forest Service land, uh, it'll be the Chugach National Forest be, will be taking care of that. And uh, also in this area on the Forest Service lands, there are the suppression agency. So in the spring, if there are fires that do hold over, they'll be uh, taking the appropriate management on those as if and when those occur. Hello, my name is Darren Finley. I work for the local area for the Kenai Kodiak Division of Forestry. I'm a prevention officer for them. I've also had the opportunity to work as the plan section chief on this fire for multiple tours. Uh, it's going on over 100 days now, and we've had well over 2,000 people working this fire. And part of my responsibility has been to help track those resources and provide the plan for all of those resources so we can all be working on the same page. So there is heat that we have identified on the Ski Lake Lake Loop Road, and uh, we're going to be monitoring that, and uh, we have plans for that as well. We also um, are aware that there's going to be trees coming down and uh, maybe some other minor safety hazards, and we're going to be addressing that as we need to, and uh, we definitely are anticipating all of that to happen. So uh, we have the plans in place, and we'll respond appropriately.